CD is full of praise. It's about praising God out of your relationship, out of what you've been through, knowing that you are more than an overcomer and a conqueror through Christ, that you have the victory, and to praise your way through whatever your trials are. Um, and just to keep your faith and keep your relationship strong with the Lord despite what the situation may look like. Because survival will come, your victory will come, your overcoming, your testimony, um, whatever you're going through, that testimony is going to come. Now the single is Praise Your Way Out. It's a super fast, churchy, yet contemporary track. Um, Praise just, Your Way Out is all of it, wrapped into one. Everything that you're going through, all of your emotions, letting them come out through the lifting of your hands, the clapping of your hands, you know, smiling, feeling joy, shouting, thanking God, praising Him out of the, you know, the fruit of your lips, all wrapped up into one church song. The ideas for my songs come from my personal testimony, you know, things that I've gone through, my personal relationship with the Lord. I love to praise and that's what I do. That's what you'll hear a lot on this record. A lot of the songs are praise songs because I love to praise God and I love to worship Him. So, you know, my inspiration comes out of my personal testimony, things that I've been through, things that my family has been through, um, and things that, you know, I've read in scripture and that I know for myself. Um, a lot of my songs come directly out of relationship that I have with God and, you know, with Christ. And now you're uh, on your own and uh, looking forward to some exciting things, right? Yes, yes, so many things. I'm looking forward to my record. We're constantly in the studio working on finishing that. I'm looking forward to come out um, in the summer, late summer, probably around August. I'm working with Chris Tompkins and we're working very hard on making music that people can pray to, people can worship to. I like that. Well, listen, you're going to uh, stick around doing the afternoon traffic battle, right? I'm sticking around. All right, we're going to talk to you just a little bit more, especially after we play that uh, hot single of yours. All right, man. We're going to talk to you. Okay. <laughs> All right, so with that, since we've got much more good gospel music on the way from the number one gospel music thing, and of course, right after this commercial break, we're going to hear a little bit more from Sean Harris, a.k.a. Sean Dominique, right here on Channel 94.7 WAEW, where we're indeed making a difference in your community. Wow, Lord, Jesus Christ. Amen. wow um, Shauna, myself, I've been singing since I was about three years old. I'm from Waynesboro, Georgia. I grew up um, in Thomasboro Baptist Church, and I sang there, and I moved to Albany, Georgia, where I went to college, and I continued to sing there. You know, I got to know the Lord for myself, um, because it's easy to know him through your parents or through somebody else, but I was able to develop my own personal relationship with him. And from there, I continued to sing, and it became a little different. It became about Christ and about, you know, his ministry and his word and, you know, ministry with the message and singing with the purpose. And here I am now on Shout 94.7 ministering that message. Absolutely. And it is indeed a pleasure having you. Let me uh, ask you this. On this particular uh, project, who worked with you? I'm working with Christopher Tompkins of C Street Productions. Um, he's a wonderful, phenomenal producer, great person, um, a longtime friend and, and my brother. Another question I have, um, your uh, experience with uh, M.D. Stokes and Victoria's Praise, how did that experience prepare you for what you're doing right now? Wow. Well, I, I was a solo artist prior to the group, um, and then, you know, I got a chance to meet Marlon. I got in Victoria's Praise, and that really catapulted, you know, a lot of different things and a lot of different opportunities for me. Um, so, you know, the group was, was definitely a start, and it was an avenue for me to kind of get out there it's kind of scary now that I'm by myself. I'm used to having 12 other people behind me. Right. So, um, but now, you know, that was definitely a great help. It taught me a lot of things, gave me a lot of experience. You know, I got to really stand in, in Mar Marlon's shadow, kind right, of, so right. to say, and, you know, see how he did things so I can, you know, do them now. Well, my advice... You are getting ready to praise your way out at the Shout Fest 2012 WAAW. I'm excited. I'm hot. I'm a lot of things right now. 